Hi everybody, welcome to my live. I am your host Lakshan from Lakshan Sense and I'm super excited to see you guys this Monday evening on Juneteenth, which is June 20th, 2022. And I have some great things sent to you today. I am wanting to share with each and every one of you guys. So glad to see everybody. Um, I wanna to talk to you guys for a few minutes tonight about the July 2022 warmer and scent of the month that's recently coming out. So I'm super excited about it and show you what I got. I got it in the mail. Um, I'm going to say it was Saturday that I got it. And yeah, I've just been waiting to do this live because I've been just curious to see what you guys think about it. Um, even myself, I was just curious. I got a chance to smell the scent. I really do like it a lot. Go over those details with you. Now, the cool thing about being a Sensi consultant is that you have the opportunity to get the scent of the month and the warmer of the month for the upcoming month a little bit earlier than the general public. So that way you can give your own spiel about um, the perks, what you like about it, get your, your customers really, really excited, um, what you don't like about it, all the good stuff. This, if you are a fan of succulents, you are gonna love this warmer. It is a beautiful, beautiful warmer. I will say that. I want to start with the scent of the month first, which is really, really fantastic. All right, so in your scent of the month kit as a Scentsy Consultant, you get 50 flyers to make sure that you hand out to guests and potential customers with promotions about the upcoming month, the warmer, the wonderful scent. You also get eight Scentsy wax bars. And because it's summer, they package them really, really cool in this silver Mylar bag along with an ice pack to help keep your wax from melting. And it's really cool because you can save these for future use. You can keep these at your disposal. You can do whatever you want with these, but I really think this is such a convenient way of um, when you get your wax orders to keep them from um, not getting damaged. Um, I think it's really, really clever, especially on these hot, um, well, late spring, almost summer, because it's officially summer tomorrow days. So, um, yeah, I always save my ice packs. So I'm going to put that bad boy to the side. Um, and they also provide you, if I can get it out here, with 72. Oh, my gosh, I can't even get out the box. Here it is at the bottom. 72, um, like, scented stickers. And that's a particular scent that you can use however you want on your disposal. I do mine a little bit different. I put these on little plastic bags with a wax sample and I staple all of them together with my information to the flyer. That way I'm able to give those out to um, whoever I would like to, whether I want to bring these to um, work with me, whether I want to put these in my bag, hand these out on the go. Um, you know, I just, I do it how I do it. And, and there's no wrong way as long as you hand them out and make sure you get that good scent out to good people. All right. So with that, uh, let's get into this scent, which is called Desert Tropics. And it's this beautiful uh, peach, pink colored wax, which is really, really pretty, right? I love the color of it. Um, Wow, and just some cold sniff, I can tell you. I really like this. Um, it's fruity, um, kind of like berries. Pineapple I'm smelling in this. Um, I'm confused about when it says desert tropic, I'll be very honest, because I don't know what's really deserty about it to me. Because when I'm thinking desert, I'm thinking like sandalwood or like I don't know, cactus. <laughs> I'm thinking like those type of scents with like mixed with fruit, but I'm not really smelling um, any any parts of like desert to me <laughs> in this. 
you know, I'm a New Yorker. Maybe I don't know what desert smells like. I mean, I've been to the desert a few times in my life. Like, I've been to Nevada. Um, I've been to Las Vegas. I'm trying to think of other deserty kind of places I've been to. <sighs> That's, that, for me, that might be about it. But, like, maybe I just don't know what desert smells like to me. I not saying I don't like it. Don't get me wrong. I like this one. Um... It's not overly strong to me. I would give this probably a scent throw, probably a 6.5 out of 10. Um, yeah. And I'm going to read what Sensi has to say about it. But my guess um, from smelling it, I get a sense of pineapple and I get a sense of some sort of berry. Not necessarily blueberry. Um, but yeah. And that's all I get from it. Maybe like a perfume note or like a flower note in it. I don't know. But I don't know. So we're going to read for you guys what Scentsy has to say. Uh, bear with me here as I get a flyer. All right. Let's see what Scentsy says about the scent. All right. So it says that the top notes are <laughs> pineapple and tropical berries. There you go. All right, so that's the top notes, okay? So the mid notes in this uh, scent is dragon fruit. Hmm, okay, I can see that. Mango and agave. Okay, I can see the dragon fruit. I love dragon fruit. I could, I could totally see that as a mid note in that. Um, yeah. Um, and then it says the base notes are sandalwood and musk. And it also says... Um, a bright array of tropical berries, dragon fruit, lush mango, and pineapple come alive after a desert rain. Okay, I don't really get, like, the rain part of it, but when they say the base notes of sandalwood and musk, okay, that might be that floral kind of, I don't know, that I'm smelling. I'm, it's not sandal, as sandalwood as I personally would like. I think I would want more sandalwood in this, but I don't hate it either. Um... So, just so you guys are aware, um, you know, all of our scent of the month beginning on the particular month, which will be July 1st, this will be available at a 10% discount. Bars are normally $6 a pop. This will be available for $5.40 at a discount, or you can build yourself a six-pack or a three-pack, um, depending on what you wish, okay? But, yeah, my, my go on this particular scent, I really like it, so... Um, I feel like, oh, it's and it's in the fragrance family fruity. That's important for me to tell you guys, obviously. Um, but when I think of fruit in this, I don't think of like super, super sweet or sugary fruit. But I don't get like tart either. Like it's like right in the middle. And I don't mind like at all. Me, I don't mind. I really do like it a lot. Um, so that scent is called... Oh, gosh. Uh, <laughs> Desert Tropics. I almost forgot the name of it. Now, I have the warmer of the month. Now, the cool thing is, as a Sensi consultant, when you get your kit, you can um, choose to um, only get the, uh, the, the scent of the month, and you would just get the stickers, the uh, flyers, and you would get the eight bars um, for a set price, or you can upgrade to... Um, getting all of those things to get the scent and the warmer of the month. Now, this particular month, I decided to get the warmer of the month as well because I really, really was intrigued by this warmer when I saw it. And this warmer is called Wild Desert. Now, I will say, this is a big box, right? And what I love, we have this trend lately of um, succulents, and uh, like a garden, like a desert kind of feel. And um, anybody that loves that kind of vibe, um, you're definitely gonna love this warmer. Um, we have some warmers that are similar, but what I love about this one that I've seen, it's very um, complimentary to like, like more like, what's the word I wanna use? Like, like I don't wanna say upscale, but like, it has like a contemporary kind of look to it, not something that you would normally see. Um, and I'm just gonna get right into it and you'll see what I'm saying. It has like these really cool three tiers. Um, this box is really, really big, um, but it's super cool. 
And of course, we have a nice message right there on the box from our CEO um, team there, Heidi and Orville. So I think that's really, really special. And of course, you want to keep these handy. Now, um, I will say this is a bulb warmer. It comes with a 20 watt bulb. Um, so just know that we have some other warmers that have the succulent kind of vibe and none of those I believe are bulb warmers. They're all element warmers. So they have like a heating um, element on them. Um, so this one will have some light to it, which I think is really, really cool. And you can keep the, the white bulb, the white 20 white bulb that comes with this, or you can switch it out for a colored bulb. You might want to give it a unique look, like maybe green or like um, orange or like purple or red. We have colored bulbs as well. So, okay. So the top part, we have um, three different um, pieces here. Okay, there's some succulents here. I'm going to start slowly taking this out and constructing it. Okay, um, glass dish there. We're going to go through how that fits in. Um, another glass dish that's a little bit smaller. And um, your, your piece there to put your wax, okay? And this is the base. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of pieces in here. So bear with me and I will take good care of you guys. So with this what I love is you can create and make this kind of your own kind of feel and it comes with like um, these black rocks within the warmer and I'm gonna talk to you guys about what you can do with these but these are like to root your succulents within each dish you can switch this out. You don't necessarily have to have black rocks. You can go to um, your local craft store and buy any type of rocks and you can kind of give it your own look. That's also what I love about warmers like this. All right, so without further ado, I'm gonna take the plastic off of the base so you guys can get a look at this. Oh, wait a minute, the light bulb. I'll put that to the side too, because I don't wanna mess her up. All right. Fancy takes care of you by making sure that everything is well protected within the box. And I think that's super important. All right, so check this out. So we have the base, right? So the base has three tiers. And even here, um, you have a sleeve here where the bulb goes right there. The bulb's gonna go right there in the center. And this sleeve here, now, I'm not sure how I feel about this because it's not uh, the sleeve that goes over the bulb is not made out of glass. It's made out of plastic. Now, I trust Sensi and I love Sensi, but I would have rather have this been made out of glass as opposed to made out of plastic. And, and the only reason I say that is because like if you spill some wax out of the top of it by mistake and it pours onto this, it's just, I think it would be a little bit harder to clean off. And I'm not sure how I feel about the plastic with the light bulb. If the, you know, I'm, I trust them, but I wonder how that's going to withstand with this sleeve. But we'll, we will see. I'm not, I'm not knocking it. I just, I'm curious about that. So first things first, we got our 20 watt light bulb. I'm going to twist that in right there. Super, super simple into the base. And then with that, I'm gonna put the sleeve and make sure you have, there's like a divot right there. I don't know if you guys can see, let me hold it there. Okay, so you wanna make sure that divot is over your cord. Just like that, okay? Just like that, so it holds it straight in place. All right. So, now we have The glass dishes here. Now, these look very similar to what your wax would go into, but be very mindful, right? Because it's a bigger one. And even though it still has the wording on the bottom, it doesn't have the number of cubes that would tell you to, that would go in the dish. So this lets me know that this is not for your wax, just so you know. So 
we're gonna put that right in the smaller portion right there just like that okay this is pretty cool so you guys can see All right and then we're gonna do the same thing with the larger if I can get it out the larger dish I got it I got it check that out oh I'm already liking how that kind of looks already look at that it's really cute right all right so with that um you can choose to do this however you want to. I'm gonna put this to the side slightly here. We use this as a prop here, my box. There we go, just like that. So that way you guys can still see. All right, so with my rocks, what I'm gonna do with my rocks is I'm going to open them and they're in like a Ziploc bag. And of course, there's no right or wrong amount of rocks to put within this, these dishes, right? So, oh wow, it sounds like candy. <laughs> I'm gonna fill that to my liking. You can use some of them, you can use all of them. You figure out exactly how you want to do it. There we go, that's pretty good. And that one. And I'm gonna do the same thing in a smaller dish, but I'm probably not gonna put as many. Just like that. Like I said, be creative. Switch this out, you know? You don't necessarily have to use the rocks that were given. Switch it out for something that you might want to do. If you don't really like the black rocks, that's okay. Switch it out for something different. All right, now it comes with two succulent um, plants here, like faux succulent plants. Succulents are really, really in right now. And they kind of have like a desert vibe which I think is really, really cool. Look at that. Oh, that's so cool. And there's no right or wrong way to do this. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stick one, the taller one and the bigger one there. There we go. Kind of space him out a little bit. There we go. And do the smaller one there. Oh, wow. That's too cute. Okay. And then I have one more step here. And I have, and I'm going to show you everything here in a second. Now I have the wax dish here. All right. And the wax dish, it's frosted, but it tells you right on the bottom that you're not supposed to put any more than four cubes of scented, uh, scentsy wax um, within this dish. You don't want spillage. So... Really, me, only thing I put in there in my dishes, I don't put more than three. Um, normally, I put in two, two cubes per dish. That's normally all I do. So, but don't put five being fancy because it will spill over. I promise you. And you don't want to do that. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so check this out. All right, I'm going to bring this close to the camera. And then I'm going to plug this in and light this one up for you guys. That is super cute. Check this out. And I love that you have the succulents there and it has this kind of modern feel, like I said, with uh, the copper that goes around. I think the copper is super, super cute. Um, this is good for, oh my, I'm thinking of a lot of places that I can put this in my house. Um, I think this would be awesome on a coffee table I also think this would be awesome on like um, on a nightstand in a bedroom. Um, I think this would be nice on my dining room table. I gotta clear some of my sensey stuff. Yeah, but I think it would be excellent here in the space too. Um, there's so many wonderful places that this could go. This could go on the window seat. Um, it's fabulous. I think this is really, really elegant. Um, it's chic, but still gives you that um, garden design. I really do like this one a lot. And I'm gonna go over the price point in just a second. I'd like to plug this in for you guys. Let me see what I can do. So you guys get a chance to see this one lit up. Okay. So I should have had this cord already pre 
Uh, I'm done, but it's okay. Oh, all right. Bear with me, guys. All right. Here we go. I'm gonna plug this one, this bad boy in, and give you guys a show. You guys are gonna be super, super excited to see this. I already know. Plug this in. There we go. I can't wait for you to see. Oh my gosh, check this bad boy out. Super cute. Look at that and look at the glow. I love it. The glow of this is super pretty, right? And it really has like this beautiful modern feel to it, right? I love it. And if you don't like the white light, if the white light's a little too warm for you, I think it's, look, from, from my liking, I love it a lot. I think it's perfect with the white light. I don't think I would switch this up. But if I were to switch it up, I'm curious to see what this would look like with the orange light bulb, which I do have a few of the colored uh, light bulbs um, to switch this up. I'd be curious to see this desert with a orange light bulb, very honestly. Um, I'd also be curious to see this one maybe with a green light bulb. Um, maybe, maybe blue to give it like a night kind of feel to it. But I really think this is so elegant, like especially with trying to get really good that brass quality in that for you guys so that way you guys get a chance to see check this out oh my gosh i even love the glow against my skin from the background of the glow of the warmer i think that's super cool like that's fabulous all right so this one it's called um warm desert oh no not warm desert wild desert let me make sure i get the name of this one correctly Wild Desert. Yeah, Wild Desert. There we go. I said Warm Desert. Okay, this warmer is called Wild Desert, and it will be discounted um, while supplies last beginning July 1st. So um, it will be available for a 10% discount. So this one's absolutely fabulous. Um, my recommendation, I personally think that because of the trend of our warmers that have been succulent type of warmers, or have this kind of feel to it, like with the garden, they tend to sell out pretty, pretty fast. I recommend if this is something that you need in your life, please send me a message, um, send me a DM, send me a text, send me an email, um, so that way I can add you to my pre-order list and we can get this um, ordered for you on July 1st, ready to go. Um, I can give you some pricing really, really fast and give you all that information. So this one, um, regular price, um, if it is available um, after the um, promotion during July, um, it will be $75, but it will be discounted the month of July and while supplies last for 10% um, off at $67.50. So, and that's US. Um, super, super fabulous. Like I said, don't miss out on this warmer um, uh, to be added to my pre-order list what i need you guys to do send me a dm at lock sean sense on facebook or instagram or you can reach out to me by sending me an email lock sean sense at gmail.com so that way i can add you to my list and you can shoot me a text as well um and if you don't want to order from me which i hope you do because i love your business make sure you reach out to your local sensi consultant they will make sure that they hook you up um, also, before I get out of here, just want to talk to you guys. It's not too late. If you guys are interested in joining my team and being a Sensi consultant just like me and getting in on all the fun, we have a wonderful join promotion right now running until the end of June where you can join Sensi for only $25. Now, $25 might seem like a lot of money to some people, but I promise you, um, it is a steal. You get a nice kit to go with that. And you also get the Sensi Consultant with the most. And that is me to be your coach and your sponsor to help you through the process and help you, guide you, mold you, teach you, support you, and cheer you on because you guys could do this. And hey, what 
it's a it's summer right great opportunity to start a side hustle if you're interested and make some extra money like and see where you can go with it right you have nothing to lose right just try that's what i say like i tried and i'm moving right up the ladder and i'm having a blast like i'm just having so much fun being a sensi consultant and i love the way sensi smells too and talk to me <laughs> about how we can get you guys um, some free and some half-off Scentsy items by hosting your own party. I love hosting parties, so please talk to me. Shoot me a message. Make sure you're following me on um, social media, Facebook, Instagram. You can also subscribe to my YouTube channel at Lockshawn Sense, and so that way I can reach out to you guys and show you all the fabulous things Scentsy. So I hope you guys have a fabulous night, and Remember, July 1st, Wild Desert and Desert Tropics is our scent of the month. And I can't wait to see each and every one of you guys soon. Make sure you guys are taking good care of yourselves. Love you all and blessings. Peace. Bye, guys.